Mr. Keck, what's going on? Good, how are you? Good. Just won yourself a uh, black and blue title. Got some, a new shirt. Tell me about your day. Um, I also pretty well. I checked my first two kids in the first period and then checked my other kid in the second. And that's... Took you into the second period to tech your last guy, huh? Yep. Tell me, uh, why the success? What are you doing that's um, uh, getting you to dominate like that? Just working hard and training and getting the best partners I can. Yeah. Compare freestyle to folk style. I like freestyle and I go way more. Like You do? Yeah. How come? I just feel like I wrestle better and like more freely in freestyle and got covered in. Yeah, it's kind of fun, like pressure off. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yep. Um, what's your advice to somebody that wants to get freestyle try, maybe hasn't hasn't tried it before? Um, well, I was watching this interview about with Joe Colon and he's saying like it's not much different than yeah. freestyle and folk style. Like kids say, oh, I want to go be folk style, only folk style, but yeah. it's not, not much different. Joe Colon's the man. Yep. World bronze medalist, yep. right? Cool. What do you think uh, freestyle season's getting picking up? Give me some uh, predictions on our U.S. world team. Um, I would have to say, I think 92 kilograms with Snyder and mm -hmm. uh, Dayton Cox. That would be interesting to play out to who's on the team. Nice, man. What else are you going to do uh, during the freestyle season? Any other tournaments? Yeah, I'm going to go to U15 Nationals. It's like nice. a world team qualifier for, like, the you know, they do the U23s, but uh -huh. U15s. And then Las Vegas, and then Fargo, Freestyle State. Cool, dude. Yep. Staying busy. Yep. Staying busy like the Kex do. Yep. All right, brother. You got anything else you want to share? Nope. Thanks a lot. All right.